Hello everyone, this is my another video sharing my experience of state management implementation in Ionic Angular applications. So this is my day 7 and today I tried implementing a simple application using ng access library. So I went through some of the tutorials available on YouTube. So okay, so uh, when I searched about it, uh, 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 this was uh, uh, the video by Design Course was one of the most popular ones. Uh, another tutorial by Gary Simon. So I went to this uh, basic tutorial, and uh, it was quite easy for me to uh, get these things done uh, as there were uh, really really lots of boilerplate code reduced there are some files that we need to create we need to create models we need to create actions state we need to define those actions and we need to uh, create the selectors and uh, we are good to go uh, with with uh, dispatching uh, our actions, selecting data from the selectors we created, and uh, it was quite quite easy stuff. Uh, so this was all about today, and uh, so finally we will uh, have a conclude conclusive video uh, weighing the features and implementation uh, details of both the libraries that we explored and start implementing. Thank you.